Stone that you mean well. Okay. Peace and blessings to the elect of the nation of Israel, alright? These are I'm in transit videos with three of the brothers from the GMS camps. Okay. You know? GMS camp in Trinidad. We go and do a little lesson on the afflictions we had to go through on a daily basis in this wicked ass system. Or you saw Poe Wien. Can't, can't understand. I'm getting greedy, greedy. This is Psalms chapter 34, verse 19. Many are the afflictions of the righteous. They so say many are the afflictions of the righteous. So if it's a righteous um, individual, you're going to be afflicted. The most I see have an upright spirit in here. You're going to try your upright spirit to see if it would be yeah, which is only sense, you know? Okay. Go ahead. But Yahweh delivered him out of them all. Out of them all. You're going to be delivered out of every last one of your trials. No sign going to leave you there to just be tried and just get burned, burned, burned. And leave you to, 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 turn, to turn charcoal. Now nah, you go pull you out before you get burned, you know? Okay. Go pull you out before you get burned. Before you want to say something, say something. Because that's why you say, take it cheerfully. Can. All right. Well, like you're about to go through in this life. Take it cheerfully. Can. And at the beginning, he was saying, that if once he's a righteous man, you understand? Yeah. You prepare for them afflictions. Sure, you could. All right? And, and, and the way righteous doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. Pleasing unto to your Hawa Baal Shem mm -hmm. mm -hmm. All right? And that is why, basically, we and the apostles from the apostles let us come down. We hold on to this truth, although we are afflicted. Can. Because, reason being, we have faith. You understand? And we know that as far as right thing, we're doing it. Yeah. You understand? We are afflicted for the right thing. We're suffering for the right yeah. thing. Yeah. All right, this is 1 Peter chapter 3 and verse 17. It says, For it is better if the will of power be so, that ye suffer for well-doing than for evil-doing. Yeah. yeah, so we are afflicted right now. We're suffering. But we're, doing it. we're suffering for, for a good cause. Yeah. You understand? We, we rather suffer now than, than, than go through the suffering that these wicked ones will not go through. Can, can, can. You understand? That's right. At the end of the day, we know in his word, because the Mosai made that promise, he said what? He's going to deliver us from them all. Can. You understand? So we, we believe in that promise. That's right. So we, so we hold faith, we hold the faith. Can. You understand? Can. Yeah, I have serious point, but I make it. Suffering from, you're going, in other words, two, like, you know, there are two fires. You yeah, don't go through the most. I talk about passing me through the fire to purify me, and then he talk about the next fire where he go and kill people. Okay. You understand? You want to pass through the first fire, the one that, that purifies, That's which right. is these trials and tribulations we're going through here right now. That's right. You understand? Not the next fire. The next fire would be fucking death on your behalf. You understand? But in this life, then, is hell. That's right. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> this is Ecclesiastical chapter 2, verse, um, starting at verse, verse 5. For gold is tried in the fire, and acceptable men in the furnace of adversity. You see, for gold is tried in the fire, and acceptable, acceptable men, acceptable into who? Into we? Yahweh Bashami, I was in the kingdom. Okay. That is where you want, that is where you want to be accepted. In the fullness of adversity, and the reason why I, I, I had this picture as the um, the um, in the video, mm -hmm. this specific picture is because that is the um, the um, the, the series of the series of afflictions that the will series be through, afflictions the that will go through. Uh, these nations, nations yeah. under all these nations, can via the, so, go ahead, go ahead. So via the um. The vision of Daniel. Can. And we are Can. the end. We are the end. We are the iron and the clay. And that is under the hands of the devil himself. Can. You understand? And we gain the most afflictions under this man. We live in um, uh, Matthew 11 and 11. Can. Matthew 11, 11. This is Matthew chapter 11, verse 11. Verily I say unto you, among them are Can. born. Can. And from the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence. Mm -hmm. From the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven suffered violence. Go ahead. And the violent, the violent take it by force. And the violent take it by force. Yeah. Who is that? That the Romans. Come. You understand? So from since then, under their hands, we suffered violence, afflictions after afflictions. 
So, seeing this is the second leg of the Roman Empire, it ain't gonna be no different. You dealing with a man who have a fucking problem against a man having a family that he, he devised a plan to separate homes. What the fuck a family home do to you that you have to devise a plan to mash it up? What, that, that is you being a devil and being mischievous. You dealing with a man who so bent out a shape that we had the birthright going in jail communities and putting guns and drugs so that we could kill each other and, 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 and sell each other drugs so that we could never rise as a nation. Okay. You live with a man who just increasing taxes and, de and um, decreasing your pay. How the fuck you go eat? You understand? And then on top of that, when we preaching the word of the most high, you're sending police outside here to fucking harass me. That's right, that's right. I'll just bring this precept here. Yeah. Good. There's, um, let me just find it quickly. Ezra, chapter 4, and um, verse 5. It says, um, Ezra chapter 4, verse 5, because the brother was saying what? That they, they, they sending the police, you understand, sending the, 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 the counselors to basically frustrate the works. Done. Frustrate the works to see if they could bring it or not. Done. You understand? It's Ezra 4 and 5. It says, and hired counselors against them to frustrate their purpose. Mm -hmm. You understand? So that way they're basically trying to do. Mm -hmm. Frustrate the Lord's purpose. You understand? Mm -hmm. by, by sending all these, these, these agents, Done. these spies. Done. You understand? Done. And these cops to, to basically harass the men of the Lord. Done. Done. That's right. The devil himself. That's right. That's right. That's the devil himself. Right? He saw. Right? He saw. He's the fucking devil. Right? Can't. You, you, you ain't right at all. Right? You're not right. Hmm. You're not fucking right. The things we're doing on the earth are right, pal. It's right, boy. It's wicked, boy. Hmm. When you really sit down and you zone, you know this man. The man wicked, boy. The man ain't right, boy. Can't. And he had the people in the, in, the, in the system wicked, too. Because they're following after your footsteps. You understand? It's what you do things, them go and do. And um, say that in Sirach 10. Let me get Sirach 10. This is Ecclesiasticus chapter 10, verse, from one. verse 1. A wise judge will instruct his people, and the government of a prudent man is well ordered. And who is the government? He's your government. If it was a prudent man, it would have been well ordered. It's out of fucking order. People crying every day, people boiling every day. That is scripture say when um when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. When the wicked bear it, really people mourn. Mm. People are afflicted by the That's people right. ain't freaking rejoicing man. Nobody in your in your system rejoicing by except for you. Okay. And all of that all of that we're doing the the best the best believe it go and turn on your own head because hey, oh you alone can rejoice? What the fuck? Is that you want to why? No, you alone had to rejoice, why? The world wasn't built for you and all But this is your world, so hey, you alone rejoice. Mm -hmm. But you're going and come down for that pinnacle because you have people suffering in your kingdom. That's right. People suffering. I talk about suffering. You go in the hospital, then, you go and see how much people fucking suffering from the sickness and the diseases you put in the fucking atmosphere, why? Okay. AIDS. Cancer. All of them things are afflictions now. We had to be combating that every fucking day. Hmm. You understand? Then we had to deal with things in a daily fucking life. And all of the hands of this devil. And then when we tell him he's the devil, he have a problem. No, he's a good person. He's not a good fucking person. He's a devil. That's right. Where that? Come on, verse 2. As the judge of the people is himself... So are his officers, mm -hmm. and what manner of manner of man the ruler of the city is, such are all they that dwell there. Yeah, yeah, the people following in your footsteps because you're a vile, wicked person. Everybody in the system, vile and fucking wicked the same way. Everybody in the system, vile and wicked, just like you, vile and wicked. Read over there. Verse two, as the judge of the people is himself. So are his officers, mm -hmm. and what manner of man the ruler of the city is, such are all they that dwell therein. Such are all they that dwell therein. You wicked, they are the world running wicked. Okay. Scripture said the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. Okay. You understand? So because you wicked, everybody in the system wicked. That's why the scripture says, because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. Hmm. 
people don't deal with genuine love no more. Everybody just on their own gain, my own business, me, 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 in the system. That, uh-huh. that is how the system is. Me, 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 I, 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 I. What are you stopping to take time to look at the next man and see, hey, I do you something wrong, brother? Or, or, or you, no, none of that. Just me. Hmm. You understand? That is how Esau had the system running. And our world could never run so and be effective. It, was, it must come to naught. Yeah. Because there is iniquity. Yeah. The scripture said that, that will happen in the last days. Men become lovers of themselves. Yeah. You understand? So you just study me, 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 and I, and I. You understand? Mm-hmm. That, is, that is how your system set up yeah. for your gain, for your gain, your benefit. You understand? Living off the poor man back. You understand? <laughs> boy. From ever since, from since slavery. Boy, yeah, you understand? Boy. Of our we work, all we hard work. You understand? Come in and enjoy it now. Mm-hmm. You understand? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I appreciate so, it. Sweat shops. Um, I just wanted to read um, Job twenty. I, cause you were saying. Like he's trying to show the public now that he's good. Yeah. You understand? Nah, no, me, I, when you call him the devil, you know? Mm-hmm. Trying to portray himself as good. It says, um, Job 20. I'll start at verse. I'll start at verse um, 10. It says, His children shall seek to please the poor, mm-hmm. and his hand shall restore their goods. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. His bones are full of sin of his youth, mm-hmm. which shall lie down with him in the dust. So he says, His children shall seek to please us. Come and open up shelters for we do this for we say. I have black friends, you know. I have a black friend. I just see about blacks, I love black people. Trying to seek to please we. That way children will come and try and just do that. Try to seek to please the poor, but they ain't going no, no, yo, we gonna somehow we want to say, you see that shit. We not on that folly with all you understand? Yeah. Continue it says um Verse 11, his bones are full of sin of his youth, mm-hmm. which shall lie down with him in the dust. Mm-hmm. Though wickedness be sweet in his mouth, though he hide it under his tongue. Can't. Can't. Understand? Yeah. It's just you understand? So basically, he's trying to hide the wickedness. Mm-hmm. You understand? It, it says his, his, um, oh, his, his bones are full of the sins of his youth. Mm-hmm. You understand? So since way back then, right, mm-hmm. in the past generation, past life, so he saw, you understand? From since the beginning, mm-hmm. you understand, mm-hmm. you've been doing wickedness. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, so we can clearly see that the so-called white man is the wicked one. Yeah, All right, the Edomites. Yeah. All right, the scripture said that they are the borders of wickedness. Yeah. It's hard to fucking eat in this man. Imagine eating had to be a fucking as an option. It's like a choice you had to make. Mm-hmm. If it's rather to eat, if I eat, I might miss out on this bill. So. Mm-hmm. Yo, you understand how wicked that is? You eating so is a necessity then you had to eat. But you studying that if you eat, you know, I miss this bill. I can be able to pay this bill and this might cut. So I might lose out on a on a benef- on a kind of comfort of my life. <laughs> that is what the man doing. Uh, but eating is a necessity, but you're not even supposed to study to eat by so food. What this so-called white man did, he, he make lifestyle and living uncomfortable for you blacks, l- Latinos and Native Americans. Mm-hmm. I understand? He make it uncomfortable. That's what the scripture say for the for the bed is too short mm-hmm. for one to land the, and the cover for too short for one to cover himself. Mm-hmm. You understand? So the so-called white man make living uncomfortable because as your brother was mentioning, you understand, you, you, you eat something, you might miss out on that bill mm-hmm. because you, you end up spending money on things to eat. You understand, it's not it sufficient to pay your bills. Mm-hmm. Just, <laughs> but I real fuck, I act that you real shopping us because you had to eat. You had to eat. So, so then what, so then what to do? You make this world hard, boy. Even Bob Marley said, boy, to, to be white born. They made their world so hard <laughs> Every day we got to keep on fighting <laughs> That what the man say by, by before I born by Things wasn't as hard as it is now And them was still balling by Showing you that this man wicked long time by He wicked long time by okay. 
Where's that boy? When the most I have a bash me, I will show you come and deliver your people. Please. Can't, can't. This man evil. I'm telling you, boy. That's right. Yeah, anybody have anything? And that, that is why no mercy going to be shown until you saw. Can't. Alright? You going to receive double for the afflictions that we going through right now. Alright? You're going and receive double. Right. Alright? You put the most size people, chosen people, into captivity. Alright? You, 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 you give them a little freedom, making them think that they're totally, you know, free. Mm -hmm. When you still have them under slavery. You understand? And that's why two thirds of our people love you. You understand? You have two thirds of our people in love with you. Mm -hmm. You understand? You have them blind. Yeah. Alright, but, but we the men of the hopeful elect, we we seen right through right through that. Right. You understand? We know that you the so-called white man is the devil. You understand? And you're going into slavery. That's right. Alright. That's right. Yo, right. so we're going afflictions after afflictions in this life, brother. And this is hell. This is hell, this is hell, boy. This is hell. Do I know do I know do I know place under the earth to go and chant? No, this this is it. This is the hell. This is the hell paro. Telling you, boy, this place, this place, this place, evil, boy. Paul said in Galatians 1 and 4 to deliver us from this present evil world, boy. This present evil world. <laughs> and that was 2000 years ago, so imagine from now then. How evil is it? Yo, we must have even concealed things from we that we don't even see the depth of what Esau does be doing. Eh? <laughs> but let me say, we must have seen how wicked Esau he thinks we just be doing a pedophilia, yeah, raping them little girls, cutting her body, <laughs> doing all of them things. We don't see that on a physical level, land. Mm. But you saw that he doing them things? Little boys. Little boys and all of them things. We don't see that, but the most I hide that from me. But we know he just do it. We don't see it. You understand? Know Real wickedness, he saw that be doing on that low. And then still implementing taxes. And raising, this is the thing where you're raising people food, how people go eat. And then you ain't raising the pay, but the food raising. You raise <laughs> gas on man, man had to pay gas <laughs> to go from point A to point B. Raising the food and GMOs. <laughs> yeah, it's GMOs, you're the feeding them bread. still, boy. Yeah, it's like you're paving the fire bread. Hi, yeah, for, for the food. fire bread. And then when they want to eat healthy, you had to pay. But you, you have to be rich to eat healthy, basically. Because <laughs> when you're poor, you can buy fried chicken and chips. But you want to eat healthy, is about $60, $80 a box of food. <laughs> How the hell you buy? How you buying that? You's a poor man. True. All of them things, but it's afflictions, but you're, you're oppressing people, right? You're oppressing people, right? That's right. You're oppressing people, man. And you, you jakes who, who, who comfortable with this boy, may the most high destroy you, Baba Kosha boy. That's Please, right, that's boy. right, that's right. You call you wicked boy, you call you good and you, nah, nah, you know, see, nah, I could I could still try to make it, but I can't make it, it's yeah, so gotta go boy. That's right. I'm telling you boy, it's gotta go. go wrong boy. <laughs> and and the, the, the good thing about the first scripture we read is that the most high said what, he gonna deliver us out of them all hmm. all right and that is that is basically the day that we waiting on hmm. you understand the day of that redemption the day of that salvation the day of deliverance hmm. you understand because even even david said it in the 16th psalm hmm. all right and verse in verse 10 it says um for thou will not leave my soul in hell mm -hmm. you understand mm -hmm. thou will not leave my soul in hell so we're not going to remain here hmm. going under in, under this oppression hmm. you understand it right. says, um, neither will thou suffer thine holy one to it's see corruption. So we never gonna stay here and corrupt. Yeah, just rock no. You understand? Right. But there's gonna be a day where the redeemer, Yahweh Shai, yeah. Hamashiach at the one hour, right. is gonna come and he's gonna deliver us from this place That's and right. put you where you belong right. into captivity That's right. for a thousand years That's right. and then you're gonna destroy like your own dung. That's right. You understand? It was already written in the script, Esau. Yes, yes, yes. You understand? Yes. It's already written. Your faith is sealed yes. in destruction. That's right. That's right. All right? Yes. Yes, that's right. Yeah, I could close it off there. Can. You understand? Yo, it was just it's just that this place evil and it's evil. It's evil. When you still have any watch it, buddy. 
people, people evil. Everybody just on their own beat and is evil. When the most I have a bad show, I bring it down. Man. That's right. That is why we had a prophecy and push this word away because, boy, <laughs> this is how we're going on falling. Mm-hmm. Let's just get one last piece of it. Psalm 73, verse 17. Psalm 73, verse 17. This is Psalms chapter 73. Verse 17. Mm-hmm. Read, uh, until, until I went into the sanctuary of, of Yahweh, then understood I their end. So, yeah, that is how hmm. when you're going to the sanctuary of the most high, that you only how you can understand that. That's because right. This is this is this this is what one bring them down. The word. You understand? No other way to go and fall. The sanctuary is going in, into the sanctuary of the most high. It's going into the words of the most high. Coming into the truth. And then you go and understand how to go and fall. Oh, it's so because all the time I'm thinking, you know, how, 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 how this man ruling and he looking to fall? Freaking Muslims can do it for you. Um, Christianity can do it for you. Okay. The truth alone can do it for you. That's right. The truth is what going to bring down this man. That's right. You understand? Go ahead. Come on. Come on. Come on. For when I thought at, to know this, it was too pain. Hold up. And that is what we're doing right now. Mm-hmm. We, we're bringing out this truth. Mm-hmm. You understand? And that is, as you better say, that is what's going to make the kingdom fall. Just like back in the, de- in the days when Israel marched around the walls of Jericho, yep. blowing the trumpet, shouting, you understand? To bring down that wall. That's mm-hmm. what we're doing right now here spiritually. Right. We're marching around your walls. Right. And then it's going to fall. It's going to fall. Right. It's fall. It's fall. Mm-hmm. fall. Verse 18. Surely thou didst set them in slippery places. Mm, so you most like Paul. Most like Paul, yeah. <laughs> to fall. God, in a right. slippery place, <laughs> yeah, you can't stand here. You must fall. God, God. Surely thou didst set them in slippery places. Go ahead. Thou castest them down into destruction. Thou castest them down into destruction. Hmm. You understand? You most like one bring all your down. <laughs> because why? We, yeah, we alone know that. We in the sanctuary at the most high. We know that. That's right. Who says they know that? Hmm. This word will bring down the so kingdom. The only thing could bring it down. This word. That's right. You understand? That is why the scripture say, Who the most high shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. You know what I get? That is the 2nd Thessalonians 2. But the most high will consume with the spirit of his mouth. It is we. You go and bring it down. Huh. And then, the missile. Then you have a shiny chariot. But this word bringing down this empire and mm. oppression must stop by it. Had to stop by it. Right. Oppression had to stop. That's right. You understand? Mm-hmm. So with that, we're going to say Shalom to the elect. Mm-hmm. All praise. Just say, Yahweh Ba Hashem, Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Ba Hashem, Yahweh Shai. All praises, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, till the next time, hopefully, we'll be edified. You know, we we been afflicted, but we had to hold on strong till now. We had to hold on strong. Regardless of what? Hold on show. Will I know girls come wrong here and take nothing? Will I know will I know brethren come and try to invigorate to do shit then? Stay holding on strong to the words I hear when taught them because these only the only way out. Alright, so hey, I'll tell them shallow one.